Zach, did you hear that? The good old days. Even in a remote town that's already far behind the times, there are still people who yearn for the past. Truly mesmerizing, Zach. This is why I never tire of small town investigations. Same goes for you, right? This body armor is empty. Is that gonna become a thing? It might be. This body armor is empty. <laughs> you just throw it. Uh, it's empty. I don't want it. I want a new one. What I really want is I want one of my monster mules now. Ooh. But I'm not gonna leave my the room to get it. And in here we have body armor. So body you armor. You can. I'll, I can keep them entertained. I can watch the kids. <laughs> no, the kids have to be watched by both of us. All right, sorry. Hungary, I, Hungarian. Go, go eat at the. Go eat. The, have chef make you food. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Keep forgetting. Go eat a late thing. breakfast. It'll be awesome. I'm not or an early mom. lunch. Watch it. Be Depends close. on what you get. Yeah, I it's close at 10 a.m. And I have to walk past the, the pizza mirror again. I mean, the PS1 mirror again. Pizza mirror, huh? <laughs> Shut up! I meant PS1. You can't get fine eating like this at any of those diners out there. Nope. So make sure you enjoy it. No. No, I will not enjoy it. You can't help. You can't make me. It'll stuff you. What do you want? It'll fill you to the brim. Oh, to the brim. Oh, to the brim. Oh, man. A seafood platter. Now let's see what he gets. Coffee. Coffee. Ah, yes. FK in the coffee. Just like normal. You see his weird, like... Thanks, mister. Oh, we didn't get to see it. you get a hankering for old-time Creole food, just stop on by. Uh-huh. Health maintenance bonus. I got $10 for spending 20 I don't understand. That's a pretty good system. I like this system. Look at this. Look at how low poly the mirror Look, it, is. It's, it's and a, the fact that... It's great that they included a free demake with the Deadly Premonition 2. Yeah, exactly. That's what it would look like if it was James Sunderland. But, oh my god. Look at the freaking, like... It's... Everything's like a shade lighter and... Mm -hmm. Ugh. You remember Ugh. James? Yeah, I like it. I like James. James is cool. He roots through toilets. I have he to just sticks his him. arm in toilets with no <laughs> with with no hesitation. That's He's disgusting. Just like, Why would anyone ever do that? Right. See? Right. And it's like, but I don't, because James did it, and she's like, no, that's gross. Shut that's up. That's gross. I'm Heather. It's bread. I'm Heather. <laughs> I'm Heather. I need tongs to get a key out of the hole between key. two pallets. I'm Heather. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, my s small slender We're talking arms about the future are too again. big. We're talking about the future again. We haven't even recorded all of that, dude. No, we haven't. And it's getting close to October, and that's bad. Yeah, so... Um, Speaking of October Scarathon, Style L3... Congrats. Oh, spoilers. Spoilers. And I picked up Silent Hill 4, so sometime we'll play that. Oh my god, we have so many games on this channel. And Fatal Frame 2. Oh my god. Crimson Butterfly. We have so much content on this channel. If only people we upload watch. videos every single day. <laughs> every single day. Like multiple Make sometimes. sure to slam that like button and notification bell and the and give that quart of blood that YouTube requires to actually subscribe to a channel and get the subscriptions. Hit the join button down there if YouTube would let us. Hit the hit the button that sells your soul to Jeff Bezos for some reason. But it's okay, we get a kickback. Yeah, we get a kickback, slight kickback. It's like fifty bucks. Per five. Yeah, so more like 10 bucks. Per, we don't actually get the money until five people have sold their soul. Right. <laughs> Jeff Bezos is too rich. He just eats souls now. <laughs> he's, he's like, about this, to is, taste this soul a certain is delicious. Lifestyle. And he's like with a, with a fork and a knife on a plate. And you're like, 
what are you eating? It's a soul. It you looks know, like a tortilla. No, it's a soul. You know, if I die from four self-inflicted bullet wounds to the head, um, <laughs> then we'll then we'll know we'll know who did it. It's Jeff Bezos. It's Jeff Bezos because he's like nope. he eats souls. Can't <laughs> he can't let people know. Yeah, when I went home, it wasn't just my daddy who was missing. Mama was gone too. Oh, that's a thing. It's never happened before. Because mom's so sick, she can't leave the house. Look at that random guy standing there. Yeah, look at the black man just staring at her. <laughs> He's just in the corner like, what it takes. what's going on, dude? How's it going? It's me, the guy Relax, in the corner. Guys. The guy in the corner. Are, are you a co-op? No, I'm not a co-op. Sure are you Melvin okay, dude? What are you here for? Ah, uh, I was knocking over the, sure the, the sheriff's shop. Outside. You were knocking over the sheriff's shop. The right, uh, outside the right outside yes. the police station. Right outside the police station. You were stealing the from the shop that the sheriff runs. Uh huh. How about staying with yeah. me in my room until we find them? <gasps> what? Oh no! Did you just invite an underage girl to his room? You don't need to worry. I can't make you any homemade food, but I've got a first class chef and a first class concierge at my disposal. Oh, <laughs> and a very affable bellboy. It's a lot of fun. I thought time. that was an E, and I was gonna be like, oh. But. Okay. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I you just know. got that. I'm like, what? You're a lady, so you take the bed. Zach and I will be fine on the couch. We snuggle. <laughs> we snuggle. <laughs> it's just York with his arms wrapped around himself. Oh, Zach. <laughs> Like he's got a pillow with the word Zach on it, and he's just laughing. He's just hugging it. It's like, oh, Zach. and Zach's like, stop doing that. That's weird, man. I just Such want my man. weed. That's super creepy. I just want my weed. Will you just? Oh my god. Hey, he's just staring at her. Are you okay, bud? Y'all gonna go back to that hotel? You ready, <laughs> Ba? Ah. Uh. Bing. <laughs> Okay, you're, let's you're keep ready. moving. Oh, I, uh, hi, uh, I, I, uh, I, uh, I, uh, I, I, uh, I, I, uh, understandable. Understandable. <laughs> hey, 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 oh, hey, 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 guy, hey, guy, is your refrigerator running? <laughs> you you better better catch catch it! <laughs> 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 okay, now let's go and do the quest thing. Yeah? I don't even know what I'm supposed to do. Neither do I. <laughs> this game That's so dumb. I think uh, my favorite part is just, hey guy. I love when people say that. <laughs> hey that guy. is the most hilarious thing. Well, there you go. I've well ever spotted. Ah uh, yes. Ah uh, yes. What does this person People have to People usually to me? can't tell. Yeah, I have long hair. It's a tragedy. Ah uh, yes. You know the pe the people who are sitting in the rubble of the twin towers. They they were going. Well, at least they don't have long hair. <laughs> yeah. Because they all got burned out, burned off by the fire from this huge tower collapsing and us uh, suddenly being at war. Oh, there's my leg. Oh, good. I was looking for that. <laughs> hey, this cement block on my torso is really pressing hard. But I don't have long hair. So my hair didn't get caught on it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Deadly Premonition actually brings the best out of us, I think. Yeah. Because we have to come up with stuff, so we come up with dumb crap like that. Yeah, dumb garbage. Okay, go to your journal. No. Because no, go journal. Shut up. Go write about your crushes. Shut up, dear diary. Today uh, I met a room. girl named Patricia. Then she's she was. She's staying uh, in my room, she's... but it's okay because she's ten. <laughs> okay. Did you know that there's a movie on Disney Plus where a grown woman kisses a ten-year-old child on the lips? Which movie is this? Blank Check. It's a Disney Channel movie 
where so, so, um so you know the guy from prostitute? Twin Peaks you know the guy from Twin Peaks uh, Albert prostitute? Albert Albert um the the analytics guy that Coop brings in Albert he plays the main villain in that movie he runs over his bike wait is that David Duchovny yeah. So, um, he runs. Why didn't you say from Twin Peaks then? I don't. What about the freaking X Files? I was. I haven't seen the X Files. Okay. <laughs> I'm just surprised that the little bit part on Twin Peaks is what you go with. That's where I know him from. He's a small child. I have to educate him on things. I'm watching you. I'm watching her sleep. Dear diary, I have this girl named sleep. Patricia. <laughs> Maybe she'll let me sleep in a bed tomorrow night. Uh, right? We need to reorganize everything we've uncovered so far. Francis York Morgan is is uh, so acting like a young Joe like Biden. Hey, Zach. I'm in a very difficult spot right now. You better choose your next words carefully. <laughs> I feel like this case is heading in a direction okay. that would be extremely unpleasant. Well, yeah, because both okay, our parents are going to be dead. I've never felt anything good. like this during any of our cases thus far. Okay. Understandable. Understandable. <laughs> but I'm in a very Why difficult... is there a balloon 60 on there? Like it's somebody's 60th birthday. What? The art on the wall. What is that? <laughs> what? Happy 60th like birthday. It's, it's just like a... Happy 60th birthday. Is from... there a five around here? Is no. there a five in this room? Because I swear, if he put a 65 in York's room, I'm going to be... That'd be pretty great. You could say that that saxophone could be turned into a five. A backwards five. Oh, yeah. yeah. It will be backwards. Ugh. Okay. Hold on. He said, I'm in a very difficult spot right now, sitting on the edge of a bed with a sleeping child. Eh, you know. And it's like, you know? Whoa, that all popped up. Yeah. First, let's go back to the beginning. Okay. Lisa Clarkson's body was found hanging under a bridge over uh -huh. Uh -huh. in a deserted spot close to where the bayou meets the Mississippi. The uh -huh. one who fired the pistol at heaven surely had no idea what he would find there. Speaking of which, Zack, Chuck, the man who started this race we're running, what's his occupation? Pro bowler. That's right. Crawfish. He's a crawfish farmer. And after chasing a poacher's boat that crossed over into his farmland, he went up the bayou and was fortunate enough to find Lisa's body. Or unfortunate. It was a very pleasant experience for him. But if not for his discovery, Lisa's body might have started rotting out there. He's a difficult person to be sure, but I don't think he's a bad guy. Chuck said something peculiar. He claimed the Clarksons were a little better when their son was still around. I don't know exactly what he meant, but we ended up meeting the person he was talking about, didn't we? Under very unexpected circumstances, Leonard Clarkson. He ran away from home, found his true self, then changed names. Or something. Sozak. Do you remember her name? Yo, Danny Clarkson. Helena Doman. The town. She was also known as Professor R. Oops. While she plotted against the Clarksons, she's the mother I of the new drug I care about all this dialogue. She must have also had a group of followers who worshipped her fanatically. I can see it now. Lena sprinkling down the red powder, corrupting every last pure and innocent girl in town. Like Lena Laura Palmer. Plan. Each time. <laughs> She must have Cause she liked that cocaine. Sack. Firewalk with me. Firewalk with me. She was one step ahead of us, and that we'd never see the full scope of her plan. Well, her plan isn't complete yet, and I know we can still stop it. That's why we need to learn all we can about her. Her alias was Professor okay. R. Okay. And she was well learned in the areas of medicine and fire dynamics. Fire what dynamics. Do you remember what weapon Lena used to murder PJ? Mm-hmm. This was a bomb. Correct. She used a miniature bomb. To tell you the truth, she surprised me. That bomb was so well placed. It left hardly any damage on the building itself, yet still did amazing work on them. 
Lena should have used that brain of hers Excellent. for something more productive Excellent. than that saga Headshot. of revenge. For example, Perfect. reviving yes. Lucare's economy from the industrial sector. No. Widen your perspective, and you'll see that Louisiana is an industrial treasure trove. With her intelligence and her charisma, I'm sure she would have found some amazing opportunities. No. Such a tragedy. Zach, there's one more important matter uh -huh. we need to think about here. Galena Clarkson, who was murdered in jail. Her body was dismembered, then rearranged into a V-shape. Patty and Melvin claimed it was a severed roots killing, but that doesn't make sense to me. And PJ Clarkson disapproved of it when I met him in the other world. He saw Galena's parts lined up and was overcome by an inexplicable fear. Tell me, who killed Galena? Oh, wow. Hmm, I wonder which one I'll choose. <laughs> Unfortunately, oh. we don't have the answer to this one yet. And it's too big a problem to solve with mere speculation. The answer to this question may lead to a major turning point for this case and the final turning point for this story. You know it's true, Zach. Nuh-uh. I only hope it doesn't push us down an avenue we didn't plan on exploring. So this seems about halfway through the game. Hey, Zach, do you remember PJ's last words? Whoa. This means there's still one more person Two out there who inherited lines. PJ's Did you see that? blood. Yeah. Okay. Yeah! Woo! We get to see Underwear Sex Phone Guy again. Wow, she's really concentrated on those drums. Yeah. It's funny how, with jazz, a very emotional genre, none of them are showing any emotion. There are six oh, episodes now I gotcha. Caught you red without the prologue and epilogue, which are each each episode has at least five chapters. Okay, so what episode? Deadly oh, Premonition. Yeah. Oh, this uh, is Deadly uh, Premonition yeah. 1. Never mind. Yeah. I was looking for number two. What the what, huh? What is going on? <laughs> ah! 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 What, what, what is, what, what was, what was... <laughs> well, now I know what my nightmares are going to be about tonight. That seems to be Patricia's mom. That could be. Hey, S, look at us. S, we got a bunch of special rewards. BO damages, seven. Holy crap. 155 pains. 21 wild dogs. But the last one had... Uh, six episodes, so this is probably six episodes as well. Okay, so did you find out how many chapters there are? No. Oh. Episodes or whatever. Show. Oh. Uh. Almost there. Just 
Please, someone, stop that noise. Okay. Did Zack have a baby? Who have a baby with? Oh, it's a blood baby. Oh no. A pointillism baby. I hate those. <laughs> a what? Pointillism. It's abstract. Okay. Boiling abstract blood, blood baby. Okay, just go through the floor, I guess. <laughs> I feel like I need to watch True Detective to actually understand what's going on. Dude, his veins are gonna pop at any moment, dude. Right? Stop doing drugs. That's making me <laughs> so anxious. Okay. That's been what? Why is there a real baby? Oh, there is no real baby. It's just 2019. Mm -hmm. Thompsonville, a suburb of Boston, mm -hmm. Massachusetts. Let me try and summarize this. Helena Doman was the mastermind behind the entire incident. Or but something. Helena Doman was actually PJ Clarkson's son, who had severed ties with the family. <laughs> uh -huh. Helena was also known as Professor R, the mother brain behind the drug known as Saint Rouge. That's right. She was responsible for everything? Uh, not everything, but most of it. Almost everything according to her plan but if you'd already figured out that much why did you continue to stay in Lucare because we had to you had to loss whatever process the goddess is still there the goddess the goddess of fertility Lise Clarkson's body <laughs> no not her she was as beautiful as a goddess, but she wasn't the goddess. She was just a tragic victim. Then who is the goddess of fertility? Remember Person in the other game when goddesses of the case. forest were the people who this is were some killed? Kind of metaphor. For example, the vast wealth that <clears throat> the red powder yielded. The goddess of fertility embodied abundance on the outside, but on the inside, she was a hollow void, and that void was threatening to swallow up all of Lucare. <laughs> Struggling not to puke. That's a good one. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Uh, are you okay, Mr. Morgan? Morgan almost sounds like a prophet talking about the end of the world. Vague, elusive, and intent on deceiving those who listen. But every now and then he adds an interval of truth. Patricia Clarkson is one of those. She's something special. But who would she even marry? To him. But if that's Candy, then she is a Clarkson. Yeah. I don't know. Instead of kicking your floor, perhaps it'd be wiser to invest in a soundproofing mat. Are you irritated, Belle? Yes, of course you are. You think we lack a common human trait. And that bugs you. We're crazy. Human refuse. That's how we look to you, isn't it? I would never go that far, but you did surprise me. Just doesn't seem like the kind of attitude one should display when in the company of others. Yes, we're sorry. We agree. We agree with you. Sorry. It just made us remember a time when that noise kept ringing out. <clears throat> we couldn't stop it. 
That flight from Newark Liberty to Seattle Tacoma. It was the first flight we took as FBI agents. The plane was shaking violently due to turbulence. And when we looked to the side, we saw a young mother cradling a baby with a frightened look on her face. We got worried, so we spoke to her. Then the baby started crying. It was so loud. We couldn't resist plugging up our ears. And since it was so loud, the rest of the passengers started glaring at us. At first, the mother and I waved our hands, trying to quiet down the baby. But our efforts were in vain. It never stopped crying. Which is why I strangled our anxiety it. Levels but nothing. rose the louder its cries <clears throat> grew. Yes. Shrill and piercing. As if they were heralding the apocalypse, we were powerless. And the baby's mother was helplessly bewildered. Once the plane landed safely, she's like, I do not know how the fuck so finally stopped crying. We heaved a sigh of relief. Well, ears were exploding, mother. that's why. Then she said, Yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Whose child is this? We were shocked. So we asked her what was going on. Apparently, sometime after she boarded the flight, that baby randomly appeared on her lap. The baby's a stand user! And baby's a stand user! Me over and kept sitting there as if nothing was wrong. Can you believe that, Belle? Bizarre, isn't it? While we were talking, the baby disappeared. It's invisible, the baby! baby! Responsible for invisible all that user, baby. noise. No, 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 there's invisible baby in part four. Disappeared without a trace of the JoJo. Ever since then, uh -huh. you gotta finish I part three before I'll show you part four. I well, remember of that bizarre experience. Well, what do you think, my fairy? Was it some sort of sign? I don't know. Shut up. And his fairy responds, "I think you're gross." I think and he's like, you're "Okay." Old. <laughs> 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 She's like, you're "Okay, old. thank you." <laughs> the logs in the center look far more burnt compared to the rest. Yeah. Cause fire. Looks like so they were used in conjunction with some kind of accelerant. Almost Probably. looks like they're in a fireplace with fire. Did you recently burn something there? Wood. It's our fireplace. I burned your body. Wait, not we're yet. Free to use it as we please. I see traces of resin, which leads me to believe you burned up some sort of toxic substance. It doesn't matter what kind of fireplace you have. Burning anything other than firewood in it is dangerous. Next time, don't burn it up at home. Dispose of it like you would any other non-burnable refuse. No, Especially I will burn it. if it was oh. something like a smartphone or a USB memory stick. 